Okay, great. So the, the topic for today right now is uh, three copywriting tips for you to boost your business. Okay, you can see in my reflection, okay, that's the computer and then there's a phone. Why is the phone there? Because I'm going to upload this on YouTube as well. Um, all right. So today's video is more is about um, three copywriting tips so that you can boost your business, whether it's in sales or whichever industry you're in. Okay, like for example, we are in the network marketing industry, so it will work uh, whichever industry you're in. Okay, now before we go into the before we go into the main topic, right? I just want to give you an idea, like who who I am. Okay, just a back short story on who I am. Uh, so I'm Sean Louis, and I started uh, as a civil engineer. Okay, I was, I was working at uh, 20 years old as a civil engineer, and I hated it so much. I hated work. I hated it because like for three years in a row, no salary increment, no increment. Every year I said I'll work harder, and I have no increment. The next year I work harder, and no increment. And the third year I work harder, and no increment again. So I quit. Okay, I quit and eventually I went into business. I was selling phone cases, which was great. I like phones. Hi, Sing Meow, nice to see you. Hey, if you're here, just say hi and let me know uh, if you're here. Okay, hi, Sing Meow. Okay, and I, after that, I went into like uh, phone cases. I love phones. I love iPhones. And uh, I was selling phone cases for three years. Hi, Suka. Ni hao. <laughs> um, so phone cases. Hi, Yen. Uh, hi, Lim. Lim. Teacher Lim. Um, where was I? Okay, so I was selling phone cases and it was alright. But I, as I was selling cases, as the time went on, more and more people were selling phone cases already. And right now, if you want to sell phone cases, you're going to compete with like Ninja Z, you know, and there's, there's no way you're going to do that, okay? So, uh, so I, I let go of my phone case business. I went into property any property agents here and uh, in property right i realized the hard truth that for you to be successful in property you need to spend money to advertise okay don't think it's gonna be free all right yeah the, the the commission is great but please you're gonna you need to advertise on i property property guru uh h property all this hey it's few thousand Okay, uh, every single platform is 3,000 and six months in property, you want to know how much I earn? We earn, myself and my wife, six months, 600 ringgit in property. Okay, oh my god, that's so sad. Um, eventually, I went into insurance. Now, insurance is the best industry to go into. It, insurance is the best industry if you want to lose your friends and family. Okay, all right, and we lost friends. Family, we cannot lose, but um, they just ignored us. Okay, and one thing I hate about insurance, uh, because people num number one is like, hey, you bought insurance before? No, no, I got ready. Yeah, uh, uh, um, I, my my friend is an agent. He's with us for ten years, fifteen years. Cannot. Okay, so forget it. And one of the things I hated the most, okay, I'm just gonna use my aircon controller. I hated cold calling. Okay, cold calling. Hi, uh, hi, Mr. Uh, Lim. Hello, I'm going to use one of you as an example. Hi, Mr. Lim. I am uh, Sean Louis from Hong Leong Assurance. Do you want to, we got a very good savings plan for you. You want it? No, thank you. Toot, 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 toot. Oh my God, I just wanted to puke. Like, uh, I want to vomit every single time someone hang up on me. I wanted to puke. And three years in insurance, uh, finally we let go. We told our clients, I'm sorry, we need to let this go, but uh, you know, there's someone who is uh, more, more, uh, was that more reputable than us? Don't worry, you're in good hands. He's a good friend. Okay, so we let it go. Okay, hi, uh, Kiap Chen, Doctor Dennis. <laughs> nice to have you. Okay, all right. For for your information, Doctor Dennis is our MD and co-founder in our company. Yeah, <laughs> nice to have you watching me. All right. Okay, then after that, right? Uh, we, I went into Grab Car. And grab car was okay. Okay, one week was about thousand six. Okay, not bad. Thousand six in grab car. You can do a lot with thousand six every week, you know. Um, but eventually, grab car, more and more people were selling like uh, driving grab car, and uh, they cut the commission. They, they cut it and cut and cut. So thousand six per week became eight hundred per week. <sighs> so you know what I mean, All right? 
So eventually I was like, this is not worth my time. Uh, I'm going to find something else to do. And that's where one of, uh, that's where Crystal, my wife, she got a call. Okay. Um, cousin, her cousin Katrina. Okay. Katri uh, so Katrina called, uh, Crystal said, hi, Crystal. Aircon remote again. <laughs> hi, Crystal. Um, hey, you want to ask you something? Do you believe in education? So yeah, of course we believe in education. Okay. There's something I want to, I want you to check out. All right. Great. And eventually we found a network marketing uh, business for us to like, okay, we could help ourselves as parents because we had kids. Okay. So it was like education stuff and, um, could help us as well financially. And also we said, all right. So this is new. We said, yes. Okay. Uh, if you are thinking like what network marketing, what company, what product is it? Not the purpose of this video. I'm not going to show you right now. Okay. And I can tell you one thing. The moment the, uh, when I started, right, I sucked. Like suck so bad. <laughs> I suck so bad. Uh, wow. I was message blasting. I was posting all kind of stuff on social media. And it's like, you know what I mean? Like no matter what you post, okay, no matter what you post, I like, suddenly like no response, nobody comment, nobody like, nobody share. You get, you, you guys understand that feeling like, oh my God, no matter what I do, it's like, it's not working. Okay. And, it took me quite a while to realize it was a copywriting issue. Okay. And so, so I was like, Oh my God, I, I, I need to solve this. Okay. I need to solve this. Uh, how do I get people to notice me? What I'm writing? How do I get people to, uh, buy or how to get people interested in what I'm writing? Because right now the big problem is no one cares about what I'm posting. Okay. So if you're doing something like that and if you're doing posting and like no one is re responding to you, right? Just comment in the chat, okay? Because I know I've been there. Okay, so I, so I went on research. I went to Google. I went to, you know, go on a YouTube, find some gurus and then uh, try to find some answer like how to do copywriting. And eventually, right, I found so many tips. Okay, there's like hundreds and articles and I just applied some of them and the... Today, I'm not going to share everything. Okay, that's too much. I'm going to show you the three top copywriting tips. Okay, the three top copywriting tips that I use. Okay, to boost my business. And these three will boost your business as well. Okay. Okay, so you guys ready? These are the three top copywriting secrets for you to boost your business in whatever industry. Whatever industry you're in. All right. And just by applying this copywriting uh, tips, right? What is the result? Okay, what is the result in the, uh, we, we, we are doing, right now, we are in network marketing for about two years. Okay, two years. Six figure income, people. Six figure income in network marketing in our company. <laughs> All right. And uh, no experience. Okay. And I'm going to show you right now, if this is what you want, six figure income using these three copywriting tips, just let me know in the chat. All right. You guys ready? This is the big point right now. All right. Tip number one, you guys ready? And um, make sure you got your notebook. Okay. You got you get your notebook and your pen, write this down. So tip number one is be direct. Okay, be direct, straight to the point. Right now, it's a different world. People are busy. People are, you know, they're occupied with a lot of things on Facebook, a lot of things on uh, um, whatever. Lah. Okay, email, uh, WhatsApp. People are busy. Okay. So, number one, be direct. I give you an example of an indirect post. Hi, I'm Sean Louis. Okay, I'm a network marketer in a company, uh, you know, for two years now and we've helped a lot. You know, delete already, what? don't care already. You have two seconds, okay, you have two seconds to get somebody's attention, all right? Another one is like, okay, basically, you get what I mean, right? Like, uh, let's say Lim, hi, I'm, I'm okay, I'm Lim, <laughs> Lim. Hi, I am Lim, I'm a teacher from a, from a daycare, okay? Uh, you, go, you, guys, you guys get what I mean? No one cares that, okay, so you just get to the point. So tip number one, be the, get to the point. Now, what can you start off with? What can your first sentence be? Number one, you need to understand who is your market, all right? So for example, if your market is, uh, if your market is like the health, you know, health industry where, um, 
you're helping someone to lose weight. Okay, rather than say something like, hi, I'm Sean Louis, I'm a network mark, uh, I'm a consultant in the health. Okay, I help a lot of people to, to uh, lose weight in uh, two weeks, you know, 20 kilos in two weeks. I don't know, all right? Just saying, no one, when I read that, delete, okay? Delete. So what you want to do is go straight to the problem. If your target market has a specific problem, straight away, talk about the problem. What is the problem? Okay, no matter, okay, example, no matter how hard you, how much you exercise or how much you diet, you're still fat. Do you want to solve this? Okay, this is, this is like the first sentence, okay? Still fat after your diet or still fat after exercise, okay? Or, uh, can't lose weight, okay? Do you want to solve it? Something like that, straight to the point, start with the problem, okay? So this is always start with the problem. Do not talk about yourself. Do not talk about your product. Do not talk about your company. No one cares about that. People just want to know what can you do? Can you solve their problem and start with the problem? Okay, so number one is be direct. Ah, you guys feel bad? <laughs> Any one of you are like, oh my God, I did that to my clients. I did that to my customer. I feel terrible. All right. Never mind, now is your chance for you to turn, okay, change gear, okay. Anyone who is uh, just joining, say hi, let me know who you are, okay, keep the comments coming. And uh, tip number two, tip number two, keep it short. Bracket, stupid. <laughs> you know the K-I-S-S, okay, K-I-S-S, keep it short, stupid. Yeah, just keep it short, okay. I've seen... I've seen a lot of people type long essay in WhatsApp, long essay in their email, long essay in their Facebook posts. Remember, people are busy. They got no time. <laughs> they give you two seconds. They're not going to read. Okay, just keep it short. Um, you know what I mean? You know what I mean? Just, just like you, I, I'm sure you guys have like, seen posts where it's like one paragraph, one paragraph, then one paragraph, then one paragraph again, then one paragraph, one paragraph. You, you, do, you, do you guys actually take time to read that? I don't. Okay, I'm just like looking for the points. Give me the points. Give me the main points. Don't give me paragraph. Okay, so in your email or in your WhatsApp or in your messages, in your sales copy, keep it simple, straight to the point. Keep it short. Short. Okay, guys. Long not, <laughs> long not important. <laughs> Need to be short. Okay, this is the only time short is good. All right. Um, so that is point number two. Um, keep like, if you're writing emails, don't write paragraphs. You 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 might want to just do like one line, one line, one line. Hi, this is Sean Louis here. Uh, very nice to see you. Next line. Okay, in this. So uh, okay. So it's just like one one liners is better than paragraph. Okay. So this is tip number two in copywriting. So far, okay? Nice. All right. Now, third one is a big one, okay? Third one is always a big one. <laughs> I don't know why. Third one. Now, uh, once I was uh, doing social... i tell you a short story, yeah. Uh, once I was doing a social posting, one of my members, uh, she go and screenshot the post. Or <laughs> she screenshot sent to me. You know what she said? Sean, your grammar is wrong. Your spelling is wrong. Your, you got a lot of typo all over the place. Okay, it's not grammatically correct. Your vocab. Yeah, I know. I know that you, you know, you are in the education line. You must have proper English. No, I don't. Okay, why? Because you need to understand that. Okay, you need to understand that everyone is a human. You guys are human. Human make error, all right? Now, here's the biggest problem. A lot of people try to type perfect English. Perfect English, grammatically correct. Uh, the vocabulary, very chantic one. Okay, words that no one ever hear before, suddenly you go and say, right? No need, please, <laughs> no need. <laughs> Keep it simple. Now, here is the tip, if you have a notebook, Write this down, okay? This is the big one. It's gonna take a lot of pressure of you to come up with the best copy, uh, the best 
uh, script la, best write up la. This tip alone uh, will let will unlock so many things. You guys ready? Okay. Now here's the thing: one, two, three, four, four words. Type how you talk. Type how you talk. Whatever you are saying, just type it out. If there's a la, there's a ba, there's a kan, there's a tu, type it out. Okay, just be a human being. You don't need to be perfect. Understand? Okay. The, sometimes I see like, oh, too perfect, or oh. delete sales message. Okay, you need, you want to come across as a human, come across as a person, and a person a person does not come to you. Uh, who can I? Who can be my victim today? Okay, see who comment first. Who, who? Kia. A person does not talk like, "Hi, Kia. Pleasure to meet you today. It is a beautiful weather outside. The temperature is thirty-two degrees Celsius, and I am here to uh, very happily welcome you to uh, a very happily looking forward to your favorable response." No one talks like that. <laughs> okay, just talk normally. Like, hey, Kiap, how are you doing? I noticed that you were uh, liking my post. Or, hey, you know what, Kiap? Uh, you know what I mean? Just talk. Just type normally. Okay. So these are the three tips that I have for you. Of course, there's a lot more. There's like hundreds of copywriting tips. But okay, I'm just giving you three big ones that I personally use. Okay, number one, be direct, straight to the point. People are busy. Number two, keep it short and sweet. Okay, short and sweet, guys. Six inch, no need. <laughs> Six inch, no need. Short one will do. Okay, short one. Uh, girls also, you don't need it long. Okay, copywriting, just remember, keep it short. Okay, and uh, last one is type how you talk. Okay, don't be a robot. Yes, keep up. It's like, don't be a robot. Uh, Okay, you're not like a build, you know, come on, man. You, you know what I mean, right? Okay. Um, so those are the three things. Okay. But of course, there's a lot more to cover in digital marketing, in sales, in business. And this is just a preview of what our team learns from us. Okay. Because as you know, we are in network marketing. We are in the education line and which product and which company. I'm not going to tell you right now. Okay. But we provide all this training for free for our team. And how much do you, what, you know, those courses out there, you know, how much you need to pay. You need to pay at least like 4,000, 5,000, 10,000 just to learn some digital marketing. Okay. From someone. Okay. Who's just like talk me. Okay. We have years of marketing experience, years of sales experience. For your information, I started selling phone cases since eight years ago, iPhone 4 time. Okay, so the iPhone 4, 4S, 5, 5S, 6, 6S, 7, 8, then 10, 10 years, 10 years ago. We started sales 10 years ago. You have 10 years of marketing experience from us and we will teach it to you and hey, we provide that for our team members, okay? So if you're thinking like, hey, I want to start a business, but I don't know what business to start, but I have no experience in sales, I got no experience in business, I got no experience in training, I got no experience in copywriting, don't worry about it, okay? Because this will be taught to you when you join us, okay? Now, how to join uh, Sean or how to join my wife, like Crystal, okay? There is a link somewhere in the description. It's called joincrystalshawn.com. And if you don't know who Crystal is, She's a very beautiful woman. She's from Labuan. Anyone from Labuan or Sabah, Sarawak, that the other side, okay? Uh, from Labuan, she's a very strong woman. Her leadership skills are amazing and very, okay, I think it would be great if you guys like saw some of her stuff that she can, she can do, all right? So if you are interested to join us in our team, okay, it's an education where we reach out to kids to help them in their studies, help, help them in their, like their education, then feel free because we to, uh, to apply at joincrystalshawn.com. Okay, because we are looking for online marketers. Okay, we are looking for online marketers. We are looking for people who believe in education. These two are, uh, okay. Online marketers and believe in education. You can apply there and not everyone gets through. For your information, not everyone gets through. We will filter first, see whether you're a good fit for us. And uh, yeah, if you think my glasses are cool, just give this a like, okay? And uh, yeah, so that's all we have for today. Hopefully it helped you. So just to, um, just to summarize what you learned, 
what I've taught you is three copywriting secrets, three tips for you to boost your business, to get people to pay attention to what you're saying. Okay, number one, be direct, straight to the point, don't beat around the bush. Okay, no need to blah, 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 talk so much. Number two, keep it short. Don't need long paragraph. No need karangan. One sentence, one sentence straight to the point, sharp, can ready. And the third one, don't need to type perfect English. Your grammar, no need to sui one. Just talk normally like a human being. Talk, uh, type how you talk, okay? So anyways, if you like this video, give it a like, give me a love. You know, right now there's a new like wow or caring emoji, okay? Just give that so I know that you enjoy it, okay? Share it with your friends who are struggling in their sales, struggling in their social media posting. Everything they post, nothing happened one, okay? Suck at writing emails. Send this, share this video to them. Okay. Cannot get any sales lousy. Share this video to them. Okay. So anyways, oh, I had a good, uh, big dinner just now. Okay. So anyways, right. Welcome to like my page, my wife's page. The links are, uh, should be in the description. Okay. And look forward to helping you guys out. Okay. If you, if you have any idea, like maybe you want something you want to learn. Okay. Something you want to learn. Um, just comment, okay? At least I'm saying, oh, you guys want to learn this? Okay, maybe I'll just teach you some stuff, okay? All right, so that's it for the, uh, for today. Sean Louis here. And if you want to join our team for more training, okay? Um, join crystalshawn.com. We'll go through your application. You have the opportunity to join us in our network marketing business where you have a chance to start up your education online business at home, especially now if you want to do like a work from home, flexible hour thing, up to you. All right. So Sean Lui here and I am logging off on this live video. Bye guys. And thanks for being here. So we have Kia, Sing Miao, Lim, uh, Dr. Dennis is here as well. See you come. It's all right. Good to have you and good night everyone. Bye-bye.